Hi beauties! So today I'm going to be talking to you guys about the different brushes that I use. A lot of you guys were asking for an up-to-date brush video, so here it is. I'm going to be telling you what brushes I use in my videos and just my go-to, I guess, brushes that I use on a daily basis when I do do my makeup. When I do do my makeup. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so... I use Real Technique brushes. Now, I got these at Ulta. I do believe you can get them at a drugstore because I recently saw them in a drugstore, but I don't remember which one, so you guys will have to do that research. I did get these at Ulta. They were really, really inexpensive. You can also get them on Amazon.com because I have seen them um, advertised on Amazon, but these were inexpensive. I think altogether, I paid $36, but they were having a buy one, get one half off sale or something at Ulta they were doing, so it actually came out really Really cheap but I believe the packs of brushes are like $17 starting at $17 a piece and then they just go up I think to like 20 I don't even think it's any more than $25 I don't know but either way I love real technique brushes you've probably seen other beauty gurus use them as well I actually got the idea from Nicole Guerrero um, I love her and I actually saw her using these in one of her videos and I happened to just be in Ulta and I was like well Nicole uses these let me see what these are like so I actually fell in love with them. They're really good. So I love this Expert Face Brush by Real Techniques. This brush is ugh, just amazing. I use it to apply my foundation. I use it to do my contouring. Um, I do take this brush and I just dip it in... Um, my foundation I put it on my hand and then I just blend all over my face like this and then I also take my like I use a dark concealer it's like a really really dark concealer to contour with and I just use it on the sides of my face like right here of up here up here this blends beautifully like amazing I love this brush let me show it to you guys it is the expert face brush by real techniques and then the next brush that I love by them is their multitask brush. Now I use this just for like bronzer or just if I want like a nice glow or something I'll just you know wipe it on my face and I also do use this to contour sometimes. Not all the time but I really fell in love with the Expert Face Brush for contouring. I know people use this to apply foundation but I love it for contouring. So I use that and this one. They go hand in hand. This one I just kind of blend in my bronzer all around my face. I go over the places where I contoured so I I love this brush for that. This brush is just a stippling brush. I have not used it yet for um, putting on foundation. I just kind of fell in love with the Expert Face Brush and I was like, meh. But you can use it for that. And I already kind of have a stippling brush that I use by e.l.f. And I love this brush. I use this. This isn't even a stippling brush, really. This is just a powder brush or something. But I use it to apply foundation. I prefer like a harder brush. So the Expert Face Brush and this brush are harder and to me they really give you that airbrushed finish on your face when you put on your foundation. So these two brushes I love. This one is by e.l.f. I believe it's like three dollars or four dollars. This comes in the pack or no actually I got this by itself. I believe it was $9.99, but it's still inexpensive. It's kind of a good alternative to like Sigma brushes or MAC brushes, ones that are a little bit more expensive. Real Techniques are inexpensive and just as good. I bought this brush. It is a C405 contouring brush. I don't remember who it's by, but if you go back to one of my iMats videos, I think I got it at iMats, and I just use it to contour, and I also use it to apply my banana powder. So when I am using like concealer down here, I just take my banana powder, I put a little bit on like a little tray, dip this in there, and I just go right underneath my eye and down my nose, my chin, and my forehead with this contouring face brush. Love this brush. We're gonna get into the eyes now. I'm gonna just start off with my Deluxe Crease Brush by Real Technique. I love this. I use this to get in right over here and I just blend right in the crease. I blend my darker shadows in here and whatever I'm going to use in my crease, I use this brush for that. Now this brush is just the, it is called the domed shadow brush. Obviously, I don't know what why I was bugging out. I don't know what that said for a second. But yeah, this is a dome shadow brush. I basically just use this to kind of blend my colors together. I love this brush as well, but to pat my eyeshadow on, I actually use an e.l.f. brush. So when I'm doing my makeup, I take this little e.l.f. brush right here, 
and I dip it in my shadow and I pat my shadow on like just to give it more of like I guess a defined look you know like it just gives you a better look and then I take this one I blend the colors together and this one I use in my crease now another great crease brush is this brush I got from Target now this is actually just the Target brand crease brush I was using this before I discovered real technique brushes and this works amazing as well the only thing about this brush is that if you already have one foundation you just want to be careful when you're blending and you're putting stuff in your crease because this kind of makes your shadow go on your face a little bit so it can get into your foundation and then you might have to like reapply or just kind of wipe off and then start over so that kind of sucks so what I would do if you're going to use this brush right here I would not put on my foundation I would do my eyes first and then put on my foundation unless you guys have shadow shields which I am completely out of but shadow shields you can get them at Nordstrom's Walgreens I believe online so I will put a link underneath for shadow shields if you have shadow shields you'll be fine with using this brush because that just kind of collects the um, the excess shadow from your brush that will fling onto your face so I also use this brush to pack on my eyeshadow now this one it doesn't have a name I got it at iMats in like the little brush area or whatever and I got it the same from the same place I got the um the contouring brush so I don't need this doesn't even have anything on it but it's just this is what it looks like I'm sure you can get this kind of brush anywhere and then the other brush that I use is this real techniques brush now this is just a foundation brush but um I kind of use this sometimes to pat my concealer on like and I go all the way up I take my concealer all the way up and underneath my eyes so this is a good brush for that as well and then last but not least my favorite favorite brush would be my eyeliner brush now this is a slanted brush a lot of people use this brush for their brows I use it to put on eyeliner and I just dip it in my pot and then I kind of go from the corner and out and draw my liner up like so and I also use it on my brows like because it's slanted already so it kind of just creates that look and I wipe it out like that sorry guys my camera died so then I had to like reposition it because I had to plug it up while I was doing this video so I'm sorry you guys let's get back into this so the next brush that I use is this pencil brush I love this because this is what I use to define my brows so I take this and I dip it in my concealer I love that brown concealer you know what? let me show it to you guys so you guys know what I'm talking about so you're not like what is this concealer she's talking about so I use this dark brown concealer for my 10 color concealer palette from um, BH cosmetics this dark color is great for your eyebrows I use it on my brows and I use this pencil brush to define my brows with it I also use that dark color for contouring as well with my um, expert face brush that I just told you guys about so this brush is great for your brows as well it just blends everything in it gives me the look I want I love this brush and that's it for my brushes guys um there's oh oh no I'm sorry I have them all laid out in front of me so I do use this this is just a clean I guess eyelash brow brush it just basically blends my lashes in with my falsies because I like to have my lashes look cohesive. I like them all to look very natural. Sometimes I'll do like a dramatic lash look, but I take this and I just put it underneath my lashes that after my falsies have been applied and then I blend my lashes in with the fake lashes. And then I also take it and just like kind of take my brows and I push them all the hair one way just so that they're more neat because your brows can get crazy and sometimes my brows get crazy because I have very thick eyebrows and I need that brush sometimes to just kind of like comb the hair you know so that's it guys so those are all the brushes that I use I use real techniques and elf brushes are like my go-to brushes right now um, if anything changes I will keep you guys informed I will make another video if you guys have any questions about my brushes just leave them below I will also have all of my favorite brushes on my blog at some point in time between today and tomorrow so you guys can check on the blog and there will be links also that you guys can go click on don't forget to stop by your local Ulta and pick up the real technique brushes and I will talk to you guys later Bye.